Director-esque men, and it's a fun thing to do. It's just a really cool thing that you get to do, but it takes forever, as shown by me being late. So, what is the point of purpose? Well, for some people, I'm explaining this. So, <laughs> for some people, they end up getting onto stuff like RuPaul's Drag Race, which is really hard to get on and is a very small percentage of actual drag queens that there are. But then you also have drag queens who go and they do stuff at bar shows, which you typically have to look up online, and then there will be certain places that are like, hey, we're doing a performance show thing, join! And so that's how a lot of people get to sort of not become well known necessarily, but they get to just express themselves and do drag. So, isn't it expensive? Well, yeah. If you want to actually use well-produced makeup that isn't hot garbage, it's usually pretty expensive. But, I don't care about how bad it looks. So I got a lot of stuff from, like, Walmart and just online for really cheap. Amazon filter low to high best idea anybody ever came up with. <laughs> and who was the first drag queen? First drag queen was this guy. I forgot what his name was because I put it in the speaker notes and I don't really have access to that right now. But basically, uh, back in some point in the 1900s, I really didn't memorize exactly what time and name he was, he became the first well-known drag queen and he was popularized by vaudeville films, which were basically little doodad shows that were shown on TV. And it had like circus acts or little talk shows, and for this man, drag performances. <laughs> and why did I decide to do this of all things? Well, I had a wig that my dad got me for Christmas. So I decided, oh boy, I can't think of anything to do with this. Might as well do a drag performance and look like an idiot. <laughs> Woo! Woo! So, yeah. <laughs> Me and my terrible eyeliner that's super smudgy because terrible eyeliner. <laughs> and my drag persona is Idalia Inferno, this idiot. And she's characterized by wearing colors that look like fire. Because wig, the fire type wig looking thing. And also, personality is being sort of more angry and devious, like, because she's sassy. Uh, <laughs> and I did a preliminary sketch of her, and yeah, that's what it looks like. It's a preliminary sketch. Yeah. Uh, I, the reason why it matches up with a lot of this is because I had just found things that I had in my room. I was like, hey, I can do this. She's supposed to have a necklace that's currently on the floor, but I didn't have enough time to put that on because I was just sort of like... Mm -hmm. Necklace. Yeah. Oh, that was pretty. Yeah. Yeah. Supposed to have it on. Didn't have enough time to quite get it all ready because making your eyebrows disappear is really time consuming. Oh, you don't have to make your eyebrows really time consuming because you have to like glue dry in your eyebrows. Yeah. Not oh, a fun, you. really yeah, not a like fun experience. Down, Whoa. <laughs> and yeah, that was my presentation. 
Any questions? Actually, you already answered that. Oh, okay. Yeah, so you, you did that sketch? Yeah, I drew that. That's nice. Yes. Other than like what oh, you're describing here, who's your favorite drag king? I don't really. Well, I have a favorite drag king, and they are just. Uh, they do a lot of makeup on artists. Their handle is Haley Wilkins, like 24 or something, on Instagram, and they do a lot of just glittery makeup and stuff. Mm. And they occasionally go do drag king shows in a bar near them. So, yeah. All right. Presentation. Wait, no, I have oh, questions. Macy, yes. How long did it take you to do that? That wasn't like. I left at 11:40. What time is it? Wow. Well, Maybe look at the clock. It took about 20, what, 25 minutes, half an hour? It's currently, yeah, it took, I got here at about 12, 12 or 5 ish. Oh, so a little more than half it, an hour. Yeah, a little bit more than half an hour. It usually takes me a full hour. This was a very, very rushed job. Oh, good job. So, yeah. yeah. You look great, Sweeney. Thanks. <laughs> Art. We're gonna make it. <laughs> my dad let me away for my birthday due to the fact that I asked for weight for my birthday. Why? <laughs> cool. Uh, because. I asked for it's my birthday because I have been getting into cosplay type stuff and that she he's cool. <laughs> I like cosplay. Uh, and I asked for a wig because I was getting into cosplay and stuff and then my dad got me this really large thing and I didn't have a character for it so I was like, oh, drag queen, that's a thing I also want to do, might as well do it. Macy again. <laughs> do you like practice this a lot? Yes. There was a lot of, like, just ruining uh, rags attempting to get this type of stuff off. Uh. Alyssa. Have you practiced a runway walk? Not really. Can well, you practice? Can you do it? Can you do it? Wait, wait, wait. Wait, wait. Can we take, like, a photo shoot of you? I don't even care at this point. Oh, 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 oh. oh. What is with these underside <laughs> angles? Go! Oh, 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 o